Morpheus Design. Morph your dreams into reality. Yeah, so here's a question. You see my videos and you see this is literally taken all day to prep this car. Decontamination, Iron X, and now clay bar. Let me see that clay bar. Look, still disgusting. This is how you prep a car for PPF, for wrap, for anything. I don't see really anybody in any other shop doing that. Uh-oh. Gotta get your cars clean, people. There's no way they're gonna be able to hear it. Okay, so clay barring the cart feels like you're sanding the car because it's just so gritty. But I mean, it's coming out so smooth. It's, this is ready, not ready. So, all right, let's see if you can get this. Okay, see if you can hear this. Go ahead. It's like sandpaper. I don't know. I don't know. I can hear it. We can hear it. Yeah, and then it's nice and smooth when you're done. Woo. Okay, it's go time for Nardo Gray PPF. So I'm sitting here studying this front bumper because look at these obstacles here, right? You know, how would you get it in there, right? You're gonna put a piece in first. You can try and do a pre-cut and kind of shove and try to get maximum because the two dynamics here, it doesn't add up. You know, you can't cut that and think that it's gonna match up because there's too much tension that has to go that way still. Not gonna happen. Then over here, a pre-cut is gonna come up right to here. What about this section? Where would you start? Where would you stop? And with this stuff, you can't see through it. So trying to cut seam lines and rematch, mm -mm, not gonna work. So I'm gonna study this and then I'm gonna come up with a decision and then we get to it. Okay, so this is where it starts. You can see this material is so glassy, but look at this. All these little things like this, all these little tits and tats that your eyes catch up, those are all rock chips. So you're gonna do all this beautiful material and then have little bumps like that. Uh, this is where I call the client and say, hey, what do you wanna do? Speckens sanding down, doing a light sanding and removing all these little, it's like craters, like, you know, like if it hits, creates a crater. That's what it is, all these little crater spots. So I want perfection, Let's see how this goes. Okay, I'm getting ready to start splicing. So all these panels, are over here getting ready so here's how i fit them all my 60 inch roll bump a bump and there's my front and back bumpers which i have sat there and studied and i think i'm gonna be able to nail those babies mm. okay these big boy pieces make me so nervous right one little mess up and all that is just trashed so we got to make one then two and then ah, the bumper's not so bad Ooh, scary so pretty though Okay, don't get too excited. What is she up to? So this is it. This is the stuff underway. Uh, looks really dirty. Don't judge on that. Want to see what it looks like? Glass. And it'll always look like this. That's the self-heal top coat that it has. Oh, it's going to be beautiful. It's very hard to see it when you're just starting. Gray PPF. Even the back is gray. Okay, I am falling in love with another product. Just wait, don't swipe yet. Don't swipe. Just let me show you something, okay? Just hold on, hold on. Okay, okay. Okay, look at this. Why am I showing you this? I'm showing you just swirls and paint. We polished this car, okay? This car was polished. It's just what happens. You can't keep paint looking great. It just, it's impossible. It's flawed, it's the sun, it's the elements, it's the way it works. This right here, I'm in love with because technically it, it, it looks like paint. Wrap is not gonna look like this looks. It looks like paint. So you have paint with that polyurethane top coat, which means it's not gonna swirl. self heal paint. You hear what I said? self heal paint? What? It's here, that's a wrap. Hood time. Just look, right? Paint skin, skin paint, paint like skin, right? It's literally, it's like, it's like a rubbery skin. Yeah, there are pre-cuts, but I mean, when you do stuff like this by hand, so much to show you today. Okay, we're gonna nail this. This is our last piece to get the gray PPF done. Yeah, I got hurt, don't, don't worry about me. So here's what the beauty is. 
those with good tension knife control. We're gonna be landing this and then this has to be trimmed by hand, by hand. Knifeless tape, mm -mm, it's not gonna work. By hand, all of it, which a little bit of pressure and then it's like a, it's like a tear, like a ricochet. And then that's it and you don't slice through, it's perfect. So I love PPF. Okay, midway through. So far, I nailed in here, boom, boom, clean. Coming inside. Still gotta make these. I'm a little nervous for these cuts right there, but I'll be fine. Okay, so you know when you do a puzzle and you wanna be the guy that does the last piece? Watch this. This is the Kung Fu badge placement. Here we go, ready? It happens fast, ready? Ah! Okay, what are we doing on top of the gray PPF? We're putting clear PPF, why? It's undoubting that marks and things are inevitably gonna happen. We're just, we're protecting the protection. We are, it's, 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 gonna, it's gonna do it. Protection for your protection. Take a look, red taillights, ah. It's not that bad, no, it is that bad, look. I mean, it's just so bright red, so let's do this. Okay, smoke taillights versus not smoke. It's literally like tail light day. So look, look at the difference here, okay? All right, so much better. And then now, ah, look at this. Yeah, look at this. Okay, let me see. No carbon accent. Woo. Okay, I'm back. Let's check this out. Um, I am ultra impressed. I did not think that colored PPF was going to look that real. I mean, I'm, there's nothing to hide here. Beautiful. Yes. Okay, so take a look at this thing in the daylight here. Look at those tail lights. Sick. Ah, oh, it's like a work of art. The best or nothing. Okay, so this one we never got to show you. Uh, it left at nighttime, so I never got to get photos of it, but this was the Nardo Gray PPF by GSWF. Uh, you can see it is beautiful. This car just came back. We didn't even wash it. It just stays clean. We had the ceramic coating put on top and it just stays beautiful. Uh, I cannot believe that there is a superior alternative to paint uh, and that is colored paint protection film. So you get the two for one, you get the color protected uh, and you get to have your car looking literally like it was painted. I mean, it's pretty dope. So there's your answer. If you want to have that paint like shine and the protection, colored PPF is the way to go. Um, pretty impressed, huh? Yeah, it's beautiful.